I teach my kinesiology courses and general presentations in using a layered approach. I first talk about the osteology of the specific area that we're at, and then the arthrology or joint structure, including all the kinematics, followed by the structure and the function of the individual muscles that cross that area. And finally, I look at muscle and joint interactions. And I do that looking at normal interactions and interactions that have a pathological base. And all these are followed with multiple clinical examples. I still feel there's no substitute for hands-on experience. However, I still believe that, I, that there's no substitute also for a firm understanding of the structure and the function of the musculoskeletal system. Of course, other topics are important like neuro neurology and physiology, but I believe that knowing a lot of musculoskeletal anatomy coupled with just a few kinesiologic principles can allow a clinician to continue to grow intellectually throughout their careers.